So I started by creating paintings that were looking at my ancestry and sort of the difference between who I thought they were and who they actually were uh, as they immigrated and then assumed a white identity over time. So I think that there is an aspect of this artwork that is also about loss and about a, a hope and a desire and, I want, and, a, and a, a wa wanting to feel community and culture while also grappling with the idea that whiteness and assuming a white identity in the United States has really meant losing that culture as well. Whiteness kind of felt like a nothingness. I just felt I had no culture. Now whiteness, I understand it more as like a construct and an invention, and it is really sort of a way to manipulate people. Because really by establishing whiteness in the US, it gave power to certain groups of people and it, it left other groups of people powerless. Part of this work came out of sitting in sort of racial justice groups and, and having an understanding that like white people need to understand whiteness and themselves and work on themselves and within their community. And that whiteness is something that is not often talked about and therefore it's, it sort of functions invisibly. Conversation is crucial. I, I don't see any other way to undo white supremacy, to help heal the, the communities of color that have suffered as the white identity has sort of established itself, you know, from the Native American communities to the Latinx communities that were both pushed out of their lands, you know, to the, the black communities that were brought here and then the white community benefited from their labor or gained privilege by having a sense of superiority. I mean, I think that we can't begin to heal some of that until we can start to look at it, name it, label it, understand how it functions in our society on a day-to-day -day basis and how like its invisibleness gives it power. So by speaking truth to it, we reveal it and then we can change it. I hope that everybody talks about race with their family, with their kids. I, I, I want it for in the white community not to be something that's like super uncomfortable. This is important to me because this is about like regaining my humanity. This is about regaining my soul and you know, okay, maybe I don't have a specific ethnic or racial identity, but like I, I have like an investment in like humankind.